Um, you'll notice, like, I used maple for this bow, but um, by the time you string it up, it's actually got a pretty good amount of gusto on it. Might be a little bit more than you want your kids to have. So if you want to release some of the tension in the wood, take a heat gun, and then you just heat up the wood, just keep the gun moving so that you don't light your piece of wood on fire. And what that does, the heat softens the lignin in the wood. The lignin is what kind of it's the kind of the glue that holds the fibers together. And it'll just actually allow the strings to bend these arms. Right now these arms would spring back if you took the string off. But when you heat them up they'll actually kind of stay bent and it just releases some of that tension. And the string will be a lot more pliable. So you can see right now the string. See after the heat gun, it's a lot more liable. Not as taut. So that takes a little bit of the kick out of the bow. Makes it a little more user friendly for the kiddos. Launches, launches an arrow pretty far. I'm sure there'll be some tears, but hopefully no real injuries. All right, so I gotta say, I am pretty pumped to give these to my boys on Christmas because, man, I'm having a ton of fun with these things here in the shop, so I'm pretty sure they're gonna like it. <clears throat> the super easy gift, all in all, it only took me about maybe three hours, not even, uh, probably an hour to make each bow and then, I don't know, another half hour to make these arrows. So that's a super simple gift. Um, that you know is going to just bring your kids hours and hours of fun and entertainment. Probably a few bent noses and some tears at the same time, but hey, that's what childhood's all about. So I look forward to setting up some pop can targets and shooting these with my boys. Um, yeah, and just making good Christmas memories. Until next time, guys. Samurai out.